So an incredible first 12 minutes and an incredible first 12 minutes for you as well. Tell us how that went and, and your goal, of course. Yeah, obviously I was delighted to, uh, to to get the goal on my debut, but it started well before that from the first kick, really. I thought we start, started really well as a team. Uh, we were com compact defensively and on the break, I thought we were threatening every time we went for forward. And yeah, to get the penalty so early on, it maybe settled us down in the game. And then from, from then, I felt every attack, we looked dangerous. And yeah, when the ball fell, fell to me and I was able to get it out my feet, feet and shoot, I was delighted to, s to see it go in. But it was one of those you had to have a fair amount of anticipation about you. It was a, a strange the way the ball was worked to you. Was there any, ever any doubt, any any thought about maybe not shooting? I feel when I'm in the end positions, it's always the first thought in my mind to if can I can I get a shot shot off if there's a, if there's a better option. Obviously, I'm going to take that one. But I felt at that time my touch was good. It was out my feet, so I thought why not try my luck? And yeah, like I said, I was delighted to see it fly flying. And of course, Tyrone Mings had a hand in that goal. Seemed to brush off him off his body on the way and off the post. It's certainly your goal, I'm sure. Yeah, definitely. You have to fight it to get that one off me. But yeah, I think I caught it sweet, sweetly. It did take a little nick, but definitely claim, claiming that one. And those opening minutes of the game, so important, of course. We knew how up for it the Aston Villa fans were going to be on their return to the Premier League. What was our plan, our thoughts in terms of entering this game? Yeah, we knew the atmosphere for theory was going to be great. Like you said, their first game back in the Prem. But uh, yeah, we felt if we start, started well like, like we did, we could maybe quieten down a bit. And yeah, we had full belief in our quality uh, in the team that if we could get a grip in the game, an early goal, that we, we uh, got the quality to see the game came out. And you've had plenty of minutes as a professional footballer, of course, but you've not had any in the Premier League until today. How did you find the step up? Yeah, I love, loved it. It's what I've been working working towards. Uh, yeah, like you said, I've had lots of minutes in the Championship and internationally, but never in the Prem. So, yeah, I was delighted uh, to get my first minutes today. Uh, thankful for the manager for picking me and picking me from the start. So, yeah, I enjoyed it. I just wanted to get, get out there, get on the ball and, yeah, try and create stuff. And I felt, felt I did that. And you've been with us a couple of weeks in terms of training. How was it in terms of playing and playing along 10 of your teammates like that? Yeah, that's what you want. Uh, yeah, you train you train every day for 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 a Saturday or a Sunday. So to finally get out there and yeah, to do it do it in a match situation was great. And yeah, the lads helped me through it to to play with the pace going forwards. Uh, it's it's good. And then the lads behind me, the, the more experienced ones, if you like, were talking me through the game. So yeah, it, it really really helped. And you came off with about 20 minutes to go. How are you feeling? And what was it that brought you off? Yeah, I had a bit of a dead leg and a little bit of cramp setting in. So them two together is never good. So yeah, I think the manager just brought me off to freshen it up. And the lads that come on, I thought they'd done really well and saw, saw the game game out. And so important to start with an unbeaten start, but also with a win today. Manchester City next week, you must be really excited for that one. Yeah, that's what, that's what we wanted, just to come away from home and win your first away game. It's, all, it's always important. And yeah, like you said, we've got a massive game next Sunday, so we'll rest up, prepare right through the weekend. Yeah, we'll be raring to go next Sunday.